Up, money? Not much. How are you? Chilling. It's all good. Well, mostly good. Mostly? Yeah. Dwayne's been getting on my nerves. Pushing me, man. But whatever. We spoke about that shit already. I give him time. He's just out of prison. <laughs> For real. Listen, G. Dwayne ain't the only thing I got on my mind. No? No. Some motherfucker's been calling me a phony, calling me a snitch, calling me all kinds of bullshit. Big deal. Yeah, big deal. Damn right. Until I discover that same motherfucker, well, he's got some real loose lips. Not bad. So, you need this guy silenced? Yeah, he hangs out with his team near the courts on Exeter between X and W. Okay, what does he look like? Well. Son ain't too diesel or nothing. And he a regular looking dude, know what I mean? Now he don't flash his guap too much, but you can see it in his eye. He a hustler. Eh? <sighs> Homie ain't too brolic, but he ain't scrawny neither. And he be styling on him a little, you dig? I mean, he ain't too bummy, but he grimy too. So he's the average one? Look, he's brown skin B. Motherfucker be rocking baggy clothes, all that. Jewels, and he stay fresh with the clean sneakers, know what I mean? And sometimes a bandana. Look, I need more than that to go on. Jesus. Here, take this. Head down there, take a photo, send it to me, and I'll point out which one of them motherfuckers it is. Fine. And that's a little gift for you. Penetrators ain't doing nothing this season. They got no one who can work the lanes, man. Shit, Lieutenant. That's something I was forced into from the necessity of my financial situation. My body is forced to rob and deal in order to sustain my own well-being and that of my immediate family. Money more than the man in blue. Ice that bitch. Yeah. is dead. You the man, son. You money. You my ice cold sloppy killer. Fucks up my business. Damn, son. That ain't cool. Fatality. 
32, 33, 35. There's someone here to see you. I'm working out. 36, 37. Hey, Brucey. Nico, one second. 40. Why didn't you tell me it was Nico? Why? Man, women. Man, women. Yeah. Yeah! Man, I'm ready for you, Nikki. I'm ready. I'm ready for fucking anything. Yeah! Are you all right? You seem a little tense. Yeah, sorry. I'm, I'm just juicing. It makes me a little pent up. Juicing? Yeah. Bull shark testosterone, amigo. Ordered online from Chile. Makes you feel really... Well, <laughs> hey, be careful, man. I heard that stuff does funny things to your balls. Hey, do I look like I got funny balls to you? <laughs> I haven't considered it. Uh, you sent me a message. What do you want? Want help? I'm losing the plot here. Pause. Nah, I'm shitting you, man. Now look, you did really good with that thing. A lot of people are very grateful. Now listen, that guy Lyle had a car worth stealing. Can you get it? He left it in an alleyway off of Yorktown Avenue in Steinway. If you pay like last time, no problem. Yeah, of course. Any risks? Nah. Easy as can be. Yeah. <sighs> okay, uh, I'll just go take care of it then. Yeah! <sighs> Bye. No risks, Brucey? Maybe this juicing is fucking with your head. He trying to take Lyle's ride. That's Lyle's ride.
No risks, Brucey? Brucey asked me to bring this by. You're lucky it looks as good as it does. The only thing Brucey thinks is good looking is himself in the mirror. Thanks. The car is in your lockup. It was not so easy. People were waiting for me. Shit, man. If I'd known it'd be like that, I'd have gone to get it. People don't fuck with Brucey. I mean, you're cool, though. You made it, man. You got the mad red army driving skills. I'll sort you out with some big rims, spinning ones, crazy original styles, you know? We'll cruise, we'll hang. All right, all right? Thanks, homie. Thanks. Hey, man. Hey, guys. Taxi! Hey! Hit me! What? Hit me! Come on! Oh! Nico, you want to go on a date? Uh... Come on! What's wrong with you? Okay, who is she? That's the thing, it's a guy. Fuck you. No, dude, listen! The cousin of that guy you killed, Lyle Revis, owes me a lot of money, and the dick won't pay. Instead, he said he's gonna have me kill that bitch. hi -ya! Oh, yes. Brucey, you got to chill, for real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now listen, NB, this guy isn't hiding, but... He's a serious... He's a serious cock out. Oh, so you think of me? No, but the guy knows me, and I don't think anyone would date that fat slob. So, I'm just doing your profile. All right, let me see. I am a vulnerable guy who needs to be held by big, strong arms. <laughs> yeah. You got to be kidding me. <laughs> I knew we should have made him a giver, not a taker, Brucey. Oh, shut up! <laughs> now listen, Nikki. I need you. I will pay heavily for this. Okay. And Roman, the cousin, you're a dick. <laughs> <laughs> Nicky! <laughs> Shit. Roman, my cousin. I'd really like a cab if you could send one to me. You need walk no longer. There's a cab coming to you. Okay. Roman tell me I have to pick you up because you is cousin or something. We need to go to Oneida Avenue. We better get this over with. So you, uh... I can't believe it. You've been working for Roman long? Ever since I got to this city, my friend. Roman's been screwing me ever since I got here. 
<laughs> yes. Hey, man, don't talk shit about Roman. If he don't pay fairly, go work for someone else. Yeah, whatever. I don't do this crap for the money anyway. I just here for the pussy, man. Yeah? Girls dig this car, do they? Useful to know. It's not the car, my friend. It's the player driving this shit. I pick up a girl from the airport. I'm gonna be hitting that shit up in a hotel room soon as we get there. For real, man. I had my hands on more tourists than airport security. If a woman turns up at Francis International, then this guy is going to know about her concealed weaponry. You get me? Sure. You bang tourists. I get the point. My friend, I got so much pussy around this town, I'm surprised there's any left for the rest of you chumps. Me too. Just my bloody luck! Dog lover. Oh, thank you. All right, man. I'm at the Internet Cafe. What now? The website is Love Meat. <laughs> Go to it, bro. The guy you want to date with is using French Tom as his screen name. You heard Animal Man. Eat him alive, okay? Roman's cousin, it's good to see you again. Yeah, good to see you. It's Nico, by the way. Come back soon, Nico. Nico! Shit is getting fucked up. I need to see you at my crib. How did the big real estate deal go? got no vision. Wants to shut down the site and shit. Make it a memorial to union workers who died in accident. And fuck you, Seth Armin. I got bigger problems. Come see me now. Your friend. Nicky, we gotta talk serious. All right, man. If you want my advice, the only way you're going to get your balls back to normal is if you stop juicing or you get implants. How many times I have to tell you, homie, my balls are golden, okay? I want to talk to you about Roman. He's got a problem. He's gambling like an animal. Online, in clubs, everywhere. You need to control your cousin, bro. Roman's a grown-up. He can look after himself, Brucey. He's getting involved with some serious cats, homie. Even people I might think twice about dealing with. And I'm one dangerous motherfucker, okay? 
Put him in Gambler's Anonymous or something. I'm starting to think he's more interested in cards than chasing pussy. And that ain't cool, you dig? Sure, Brucey. Thanks for the heads up. Thank you. Have a nice day. Escuela combines a powerful Powerf urban masculinity with a lighter, lighter side. side. Here, shortly after cleaning up five blocks, he teaches, teaches a group of uh, Yo, man, you made me look gay, man. I warned you, bro. What? No, you don't look gay. You look a little metrosexual or something. Metro's it's good. It's good. Man, who the hell ever heard of a metrosexual ex-gangster, hey. man? I'm a lord, man, not a lady. This show is gonna make me famous. You are gonna be famous. Shit. Yo, Nico, man, what am I supposed to do here, man? I got this film genius here making me look like a transsexual or something on TV, and now some punks been talking all kinds of shit too. What punks? Man, bitches I used to roll with, guys caught up in the game, punks in too deep, man. Yo, I tried, man. I tried to be a good guy, I said I'm reformed, man. But I'm pure ghetto, man. And this show's garbage. Oh, come on. We don't have to kill a shot, what? man. Jeez. We need to go bust somebody, man. Uh... Do what you want, as long as it doesn't involve me. Hey, yo, man, we're brethren, right? Give it up, man. All right, man, yo, listen, can you shut these punks up for me, please? Where are they? They're gonna be coming in on the L train, man, from Algonquin to Dukes, man. Hey, I owe you, man. I owe you big time. Okay. You see that, man? You see that, man? Yo, that is streets right there, man. Not none of this shit. Got me dancing in skirts with people in the neighborhood. Man, what the fuck is that, man? You don't need to worry about people talking garbage no more. Yeah, you're pure ghetto, man. Just like me, kid. I'm gonna thank you in all my acceptance speeches, man, for real.
Were you followed? Hey, strange seeing you here, Officer McCreary. I told you to come here, fucking maggot. You did? Why? I know about you. Know what? I know enough, boy. Oh, what do you know, boy? I know you killed Mikhail Faustin. I know a group of Russians want you dead. I know you ain't no saint, boy. I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. <laughs> You think this is a town that can keep a secret? I really don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. You know that a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. That people ain't perfect, that life is a mess. Sure, everybody knows that. So, you look out for me, and I don't look out for you. <laughs> know what I mean? I think so. So there's a guy trying to blackmail me. Who? I don't know. Thinks he's getting paid, though. The guy's smart. He arranged to do the exchange by the Humboldt River off Silicon Street. Said to call him from the viewpoint there. Okay. Listen, I did what I did. <laughs> I made a mistake. That don't make me the devil. Now obviously I can't go, because then he gets a picture of me giving him money and I'm admitting guilt. I ain't guilty of nothing other than being a man. To be honest, I don't really care one way or another. Well, I'm a good man. No doubt. Now call me when you get to the spot. I'm in the park. Now what? All right. This guy told me to bring the money there and call him. That means he's somewhere close and he's got a phone. I'm gonna text you his number. You've got to call him and keep a lookout for someone answering a phone. He won't be far. Friend, I'm calling about your exchange with McCreary. Yeah? You better have my paper. I ain't fucking around. I'm sure he's got your money. Have you got the stuff he wants? Yeah, I got it. We're gonna make this shit happen. I don't mess around, you know. Push me, and this shit is all over Weasel News. I got them on speed dial. Really? 
Yeah, and there's a lawyer called Tom Goldberg who's real interested. He's hungry for McGreary's blood and shit. Yeah. Good thing Francis is paying, then. Call me when this exchange is going down. I don't like all the talking. Be cool. Dispatch three units from Lancaster. Here, he's dead. Great, I can get rid of these now. I feel like a new man. Not many people get a second chance like this. It's my redemption. Your sins are absolved, I guess. I forgot to set me in a pussy hole. Yeah, fuck you, fucking reggae idiot bitch! Rondo, you want blood clot because I didn't even bomb a clot right Stop here. Stop speaking now. that gibberish! You fuck bomb a clot pussy hole, girl. You know this? Shot in a bomb a clot. Hey, yo, hey, don't hey, touch what's this! What's wrong? What's wrong? Jacob here. You know Jacob? Yes. Jacob tells me it wasn't him, but some people he introduced me to had ripped me off big time and put the heat on me. I know they all did. All right, all right, but all right. And on my fault to the rasta. And my blood well, clap hey. You don't come in on my face. All right. You better hope Nico can make this right for you then. Oh, what? Oh, we got a big fucking problem, Rasta. Nico, go do this first job for him. Yeah, I got it. Watch me, Anna. See you later. Watch me now. This is scale fish, imported straight from Bolivia, manito. Polvo puro, the best, man. You're in America now. The best everything gets made here. If the best stuff got made in Mexico or Colombia or wherever, why do you all run across the border? Tell me that.
house is mine. I'm doing you a favor, you ugly bastard. Screw you! Okay, okay. Don't kill me, man. You got no way out, asshole. <laughs> I've got this stuff. You know where the heat is coming from? I think I'm getting closer now. But there's one more cat me have to speak to. Shit! Speaking of fucking cops, I think I have company. I gotta go. I lost the heat. Where are you? Cheers, Pine. I'm with some buckets and no eye. Get your now, Nico. Let's be some strange shit. Jacob, what are you talking about? You know, I think you're smoking too much. Yo, me think me know the eater come from in a king. Hey, Nico. Hey, Jacob. What are you doing here? This is no place for you, Michelle. As it happens, it is. You see, Nico, I have been working for the government. I'm afraid it's my job to watch you. And now I have to ask you for the coke. This is a joke, right? Please, please don't make this harder for me than it already is. Look, they're about to take down Elisabetta. I don't fucking believe this. Listen, I'm sorry it had to be this way, Nico. I'm really sorry. Hey, you know, you could have gone down too if you weren't so useful. You fucking bitch. Nico. Hold on. You mean to say you're going to let us off just like that? Not now, Guan? Well, my employers need the help of a guy like Nico. The office is in Algonquin. 
I'll call you. You know, as and when we need you. The Coke, please. Shocking, we have to tell Elizabeth so she now get our cocky in now. Mind me? That doesn't matter. You need to meet me outside the United Liberty Paper Building in Algonquin. It is very important that you be there. Goodbye. Hey, man, this is getting out of control. The police are all over me. I can feel them. So? 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 So I'm gonna go to prison for a long time. <laughs> so my life is over. Oh, God, all this work for nothing, man. Oh, being tough in a man's world. Guess I wasn't so tough, huh? Oh, he turned state. Everyone's a rat. Not me. Whatever. Open up, man. Who is it? It's the streets, man. Okay, hold on. All right, man. Oh. This is what Manny's oh. all about, man. Manny, 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 Manny. Now, word up, bitch. You better stop slinging that shit on my streets, yo. We don't want it anymore. Hey, OJ, you catching this? Rolling, Who rolling. Is this, Manny, for fuck's the sake. The streets have spoken. Now leave my people alone. Are you Nico? What are you doing here? Oh. I am not in the mood for this right now. Well, he said he was going to bust the dealer. Can you help me clean this mess up? There's a doctor and broker who can help. Come on, let's put him in my car. Oh. Jacob, I'm sorry. I'm already hanging out with two friends. I've kind of got my hands full looking after them. Uh, we should do something soon, though. Got some bodies in here. I've heard you'll take care of them. Uh, natural causes? Of course. Seems like a bullet in the head is as natural as it gets in this town. They weren't sick, were they? No. Had a few problems with sick bodies. No one wants a liver if it's riddled with tumors, huh? Know what I mean? No. Shit. Looks like the bullet went right through this one's eye. 
and the price of eyes is through the roof at the moment. <sighs> Fine. Can I leave you with these or what? Sure. I'll have these organs out on the street in no time. They're gonna help a lot of folks. <sighs> He'd been trying to help the streets his whole life. Maybe he'll actually be doing it now. The doctor has that stuff. Good! One last thing to bother me. The heat is closing Get in, Nico. This particular party is ending. Hey, this is Mallory. Leave me a message and I'll hit you back. Patrick McCreary. You and me did some work for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to Mama's on Savannah Avenue in Meadows Park. I'm always in need of money. See you there. Hi. Listen, I know what you must be thinking, but don't bother. I'm sorry, but I don't see how you know what I must be thinking. You've killed people. <sighs> you should be dead yourself. Or inside. You're just lucky it was me and not someone else who got their hooks into you. I'm sorry that I lied to you. <sighs> and, and weirdly, in some ways, you're a nice guy. Better than the creeps I normally date. But you're damaged goods. No doubt. Let's go. In here. Salute? Eat my ass, buddy. I'm up for the promotion, and you're not. What the hell are we doing here? We're going to meet someone. Sounds fun. You know, you and your cousin, you should get out. What you're looking for, you won't find. Feds are all over it. Crime is done. You've watched too many movies. Whatever you say, Michelle, or whatever your name is. It's Karen. My name is Karen. Interesting. And you whore for the government. I kind of like the honesty in that. I have a clear conscience. How very lucky for you. <sighs> in here, Office 396. Hi there. Here he is. I can see that. Thanks, Karen. Hey, cheer up. You did good. You'll get a Sammy if you care about that sort of thing. Thank you. So, Mr. Bellique, quite a file, quite a story. Who are you? If I be? If I be? Do I look homosexual? Do you think I care about the size of your Johnson? Now, you can't always tell who the good guys are. I'm not a good guy, but I'm fighting with them. And guess what? So are you. Hooray. That's the spirit. Nothing like a bit of sarcasm when someone's got you by the balls. Now, I need you to find something out for me. Find out everything you can about a man called Oleg Minkoff. He lives on Iroquois, back in Hove Beach. And if I say no? I hand your file over to those cretins in the FIB, and organized crime has dealt another serious blow. Go to his house. Any problems, call this number. Hmm. What's your name? Not relevant. Call me. Very soon. Go. And hey. Welcome to America.
Pascal Astara Dejava. Bushka. Mr. Minkov? Anybody here? What have you got for me? Not much. He keeps a clean house, he's got a computer. Check his emails. Call back with any information that would indicate his current whereabouts. There's an email that says he's meeting someone at Tulsa Street in Hove Beach. Perfect. I'll send someone to pick up the hard drive. You go to Tulsa Street. Eliminate Minkoff. Whoa. Killing is very different from gathering information. You are acting in the interest of your new countrymen and keeping yourself out of prison. For once, this is a murder you don't have to feel confused about. Dispose of Minkoff. Then call me. Василий, спасибо, что пришел. Олег, ты испугал меня. Я даже подумал, что это человек. Пос... Все, он меня дожидался. Пока, братан. Minkoff is dead. The country is safe. Not by a long shot, smartass. Nothing is safe. No one is safe. Maybe something has been averted. Maybe delayed. I'll be in touch. Goodbye. Come in, Nico. Hi. So, you fought in the war. You know a lot. Yes, you're looking for some people. <sighs> We're all looking for that special someone. But most of us don't want to kill them when we find them. Most murders are committed by people you know. Most wives are killed by their husbands. Yes, and my wife had better stop sleeping with that tennis coach or... <laughs> I'm joking. I'm sure your wife doesn't need to sleep around. Well, I'm joking. 
I'm sure she does. Funny. I'm divorced. My wife can sleep with whoever she wants. Interesting. I'm not divorced. I was never married. No details. I need you to go find someone for me. I'll be getting a picture through shortly. This is important. So why use me? We always use people like you. Karen, Michelle, she was the same. Someone with something to lose, but not much to live for. What's in it for me? Two things. One, you don't get a hundred murders pinned on you. Two, maybe I will help you. And maybe I won't. Now get access to a police computer and wait for my message. Go! I found this place. There are a bunch of guys hanging around. Well, he must be in there, Nico. Dispose of them all. We're doing a favor for our comrades in the East. You better start doing me some favors soon. Time to split my butt like Yugoslavia. <laughs> serve your purpose? Yes. Then you are that much closer to finding the man you are after. That strange feeling deep inside? That's the feeling of satisfaction after you did something good. Congratulations. Goodbye. Nico, I heard that Michelle was a cop or a fed or something. Is it true? I don't know what she is, but she was lying to us all along and now I'm paying for it. This guy. There was always something funky about her. I'm real sorry. Nico, I'm getting worried. Roman didn't get back at all last night. 
He likes to party. He stays out late the whole time. You know what he's like. Not on my watch, he don't. Something ain't right. What's up, money? Hey. Man. Business is tough. Now, I ain't a cold person. I, well, I mean, I am cold, but... Motherfucker. What are you talking about? You want a drink? Uh... Man, have a seat, man. All right. Now, I got into this dope gang because it was the only thing that was open to me, man. The only thing, man. Hey, I am not judging. No, listen, now, I paid my dues. Now, I learned in a hard school, man, and I changed stuff. You know me. I do this stuff so I got a chance to do some good in this town. So you say. So I say. So I do. When I get the money, man, I will build parks. I will sponsor kids. I will save lives. But I got to have the money, man. Is all this? All this, it means nothing if you ain't got the heart, Nico. Amen, brother. <laughs> I mean, fuck, man. Fuck! The thing is, you know, Jesus, he did some crazy shit, too. I mean, everyone does. He killed people. He killed that John the Baptist cat. He did what he had to. I don't think you're correct about that. Man, the point is, man, history <laughs> is a long time. And you only got one chance. And Dwayne, man, Dwayne, it's like he thinks it's 1992, and the best that you could hope for is a gold chain and a pager. You know, he looks at me like he wants me dead. And I took care of business. I gave him money, but because I won't bow down to him and treat him like he the almighty, motherfucker wants to pop me. Dwayne is a little troubled. He was in prison a long time. Maybe you guys should talk. No, I tried talking. No, I. I tried giving him half of the business. I tried everything a man could reasonably try and still call himself a man. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Kill him? Hey, I didn't say that. Man, you cold. I was joking. But what else is there? I mean, Cash been talking. Now I hear things. Said you and me was too tight now. Said you disrespected him. Called him mad. He's going crazy. I mean, he's gone. Prison does that. Well, you can't kill him. Nope. But you can. But I don't want to. Well, neither do I, man. But if he goes insane, we all dead anyway. I mean, Dwayne is a killer. Ah. I don't like this conversation. Do you think that I do? But it's kill or be killed out there. You got a lunatic after you? Man, you dumb. <coughs> now, I will give you a lot of money. Because see me? Now, I ain't scared of no one. But a motherfucker says he's going to kill me, the motherfucker's going to die. <sighs> Man, I'm not sure. I got to think about it. Well, I hope you see some sense. I will be in touch.